more than just what human strength can do, Amen. but the miracles of heaven Amen. are going to start happening. Amen. And I see even in the villages, like a little boy with a broken leg being healed in Jesus' name. Amen. And people just being amazed at the glory of God. You know, I see a, a, a young girl that's uh, mentally uh, disturbed and it's a demonic thing. And that as you preach the gospel, that this young girl is going to be set free and is going to be uh, whole and, and, and happy and, and just be amazing to that village. And so this is not just in the uh, Christian villages. I believe those two things are in two new villages uh, that God is going to lead your people to. Two villages where uh, people haven't been as yet. And as they go, these miracles are going to happen. And the Lord says, I'm going to start a fire in Yangon. That there will be a, a new passion amongst the believers, but there will also be new revelation. There are people I'm going to raise alongside you of a prophetic anointing. Uh, you know, even your own wife, God would say that, that I'm going to give her visions and dreams. I'm going to awaken her to the things of the Spirit in a whole new dimension. And you are going to have this apostolic prophetic dimension added to the ministry that you already exert. And the Lord says, as you seek the Lord in prayer and fasting, Amen. there is going to come a breakthrough in the miraculous. The young ones that you have in the orphanage are going to do great and mighty things. Amen. They are going to do great and mighty things. Amen. Some of them, it will be uh, in the secular arena that they will achieve far more than can ever have been expected of such young people. Amen. And he will raise them up like Daniels and Joseph Amen. in the secular realm. Amen. But there will be others among them, young apostles, young prophets, young evangelists. And the Lord says that as you are faithful to preach about the fivefold ministry, then you will raise up new fivefold ministers. And, and they are not just to be pastors. And the mindset is to be broken that uh, ministers are just pastors. And the mindset needs to be that there will be apostles, there will be prophets, there will be evangelists, there will be pastors and there will be teachers. And the Lord says that these are the two things that are going to take the church forward as there is true fivefold ministry released, but also as the saints rise up in ministry, the revival of the saints. It's not just the pastors doing the work. There is a revival of the saints and Amen. you are going to play a role of leadership in Amen. this by believing for miracles in your own ministry and filtering down like the anointing of uh, Psalm 103 from the head down through the whole body. I see miracles happening and young people prophesying and I see people going out into the streets and laying hands on the sick and they shall recover, my brother. And you'll be part of this fire that will spread through Yangon. Amen. A fire of the gospel and Amen. a fire of the power of Amen. God touching people's lives in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.